season brings Mrs. Kennedy to a children's hospital in Washington for a visit with ill and crippled children. 55 holiday seasons ago, the First Lady was doing what so many have since, making ceremonial appearances, pushing social causes. Just say no. Sometimes grappling with governmental issues. We know we can get savings. But when Donald Trump's wife, Melania, slips into that role, it is now clear she will have company. It's so his older daughter, Ivanka, is expected to play a major part in the pageantry and policies of his presidency. He will deliver. Ivanka is incredibly committed to women in the workplace, women in the economy, women entrepreneurs. She is, uh, she's, she's had a wonderful platform during the campaign. Certainly she and her father announcing the child care and elder care plan, I think was a, a big highlight of our campaign, their outreach to women particularly. Already there is talk about Ivanka having an office at the White House. Since her role is not yet defined, the transition team is pushing back on that. But she and her husband have been house shopping in D.C. She's Instagrammed about her father's summit with the tech industry, sat in on chats with world leaders, helped arrange a meeting with Al Gore to talk about climate change. I found it an extremely interesting conversation. The Ivy League educated 35 year old has been a key player in her dad's business empire for a long time and she's helped temper his hottest moments on the campaign trail too. While I, uh, I do sometimes tell him to, to withhold some of that sort of fire, I also understand it and I think it's instinct and I think it also speaks to his passion. In return, he openly admires her intelligence, drive, and sometimes to an uncomfortable level, her looks, as it was on The View a half dozen years ago. If Ivanka weren't my daughter, perhaps I'd be dating her. You know? <laughs> Stop it! Oh, it's so weird! <laughs>